District 186 principals now making plans after their school report card rankings. The Illinois State Board of Education ranks schools from exemplary to intensive. Schools now using those numbers to develop target strategies in areas that are lacking. However, there seem to be a common message from each principal. We are far more than just the numbers that you see. We actually have worked very diligently with um, the AIR supports to help us better our school improvement practices. We maintained the roof that we had, but we did not boost it up just, just a little bit more to do better. Officials say the state board will provide extra support to lower ranked schools, including a partnership with American Institutes for Research to do assessments, depending on the school's ranking. And developing this morning as we enter the final days of veto session here this fall, Republicans are making a final effort to save a scholarship program. The Invest in Kids scholarship program is set to expire at the end of this year and allows low-income students a chance to attend private schools that may be a better fit for them. Officials say more than 9,000 Illinois students are in the program, and this is the last chance lawmakers have to save it. Advocates gathering at the Capitol during this veto session to encourage lawmakers to extend the program. In two days, we're going to be done. And we either leave here with our heads held high because we have acted and saved opportunity for these low-income students. Kent Redfield, a former political science professor at UIS, says lawmaker concerns come from taking money away from other programs, like public schools. This, as Governor Pritzker says, his focus is support for public education. We're not trying to prevent people from going to, to private school, um, but uh, I also believe in public education and want to make sure that we're funding public education uh, to the extent that uh, that is possible. The Invest in Kids scholarship program has been in place since 2017. Private donors fund those scholarships for low income children so they can attend a private school. Senate Republicans are encouraging a vote on the Invest in Kids scholarship program this week.